Canada, it's your boy Daniel, and we are out here in Toronto here today, and we come out to ask this simple question that we ask around the world. What you know? We just want to know what you know. If you know anything you know, you may know I'm in a but we just want to know what you know. Let me go. I'm from Trinidad, right? Okay, cool. So Love I'm it. so I'm so I'm gonna give you a Trinidadian pickup line okay. and I want you to use it. Okay, cool. Right? So it goes like this. Girl, you're like barbed wire because I just can't get over you. Try and say it. Yeah, you're like barbed wire because I can't just get over you. From the whole of Siparia, from that beginning, nobody I want that. Can you spell the word Canada for me? C A D A N A. <laughs> Which planet are we on right now? I do not know. I do not know. Oh my god. Which planet? Oh, this is a good question. <laughs> a planet? Can Canada? I don't know. <laughs> if Y-E-S spells yes, then what does E-Y-E-S spell? Yes. <laughs> E-Y-E-S. Yes. <laughs> Can you spell the word top for me? Top? Yeah. T O P. Say the word top for me two times, real fast. Top, top. And say it for me four times, real, real fast. Top, 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 top. What do you do after a green light? You stop. You what? After a green light? You go. <laughs> so. <laughs> if Y E S spells yes, then what does E Y E S spell? Ace. Yes. What are we doing? Ace, yeah, Ace. No, God. A E Y S, Ace. Ace. Yeah. Like, like Ace. Yeah, Ace. Ace. <laughs> Which country is the Panama Canal located in? Nope, no, definitely not that one. I don't know that one, Panama Canal. Definitely. So which country is the Panama Canal located in? U.S. No. Okay. Seven and six is. Twelve. Oh no, no, no. What is the capital of Canada? Ottawa. What about the national motto of Canada? What's the national motto? A. <laughs> um. Sorry, I'm sorry. National motto of Canada. Uh, God, I, I have no clue. This show is all about education through entertainment. Okay. So I want to make sure that you learn something okay, before please. you leave yeah, here today. No, I love. Please. The national motto of Canada is Amari Uske Almari. <laughs> yeah. And that's. Yeah. Uh, Amari Uske Almari. Almari Uske Almari. Right, and that's okay. and that's Latin for from sea to sea. From C to C. Okay, yeah. that makes sense. Correct. That makes sense Correct. from Newfoundland Correct. to BC. Correct. I Correct. understand. Yeah. So Perfect. tell Canada what you learned today. Well, we have a national motto, which is, say it with me again. Amari Uske Armari. Almari Uske Almari. Which is Latin for? Coast to coast. Yeah. From BC to Newfoundland. Yeah. And that we love Canada and we're trying to figure out new pickup lines because we suck at them. Yeah, you're like barbed wire because I can't get over ya. You don't know. You don't know. All right. I go on. If Y E S spells yes, then what does E Y E S spell? You see, there is uh, an old saying: half knowledge. When you say I don't know, it's almost half knowledge. So that one I don't know. E yes, E Y E S. Yes. So I want to transpose that letters. Or okay, okay. So if Y E S spells yes, yes. Yeah. what does E Y E S spell? Oh, <laughs> E Y. Say that again, brother. I'm very excited because yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, we have all day, man. I mean, come on. If Y E S yes. spells yes, okay. then what does E Y E S spell? E Y E S. Oh yes, that's ice. <laughs> you don't know. E Y E S. E Y E S. E Y E S. Yeah. Yeah. Which 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 word is it? A E for Eden Center. Y for Y like boy and Y. <laughs> e 
E4 into a center and S is like supermarket. <laughs> if Y E S spells yes, then what does E Y E S spell? E S. Yes. E Y E S. Yes. 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 With E silent if. If it is E silent, then yes. Oh, 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 so, <laughs> so the E, so the E is silent. Yeah, then it's yes. <laughs> oh, okay. Come on, I mean, obviously the E is silent, so it's like E Y E S, but. <laughs> then it's yes. <laughs> cool. You sure? So if Y E S is yes, then what is E Y E S? E S. Try again. Yes. E S. E Y E S. E Y -E S. Yes. Ice. I'm not sure. It's ice. Come, 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 come. Oh. <laughs> come on, tell him now. Come on. Your mom yeah. had four kids. Okay. North, south, east, and one more kid. What was the name of the last kid? West. Huh? West. 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 No, you were the last kid because it was your mom. Oh, but she doesn't have four kids. <laughs> oh, but she doesn't have four kids. <laughs> <laughs> Which planet are we on right now? Earth. Ah, no, so simple, man. Uh, this is the second question here. Nothing too difficult. If Y E S spells yes, then what does E Y E S spell? Eyes. Ah, no, no, so <laughs> no, you know your stuff, man. This is the third question here. How many provinces and territories are there of Canada? Ooh. It was 12. I believe it's 13 now. All right. Yeah. All right. And this is the fourth question here. Nothing too difficult because you know it's only simple questions. Can you spell the word Quebec for me? Q-U-E-B-E-C. Right. And this is the final question. And if you answer this question correctly, I'm going to give you some cash. So you ready for the question? Understood. You sure you're ready for it? Okay. You're positive? Absolutely. You're ready? Uh-oh. Uh, I'm ready. All right. What is the national motto of Canada? The Maple Leaf. Oh, the national motto of Canada. Yeah. The national motto of Canada. Right. Uh, ooh. Okay, here's that's what. A, that's a tough question. It's, yeah, I didn't get it. Uh, okay. This show is all about education through entertainment, right? Okay. So, the national motto of Canada is Amari Uske Almari. Armari, Uske Armari. Right, which stands for from sea to sea. So it's Latin for from sea to sea. Okay. But because I really like you, I'm going to give you one more question to replace that question. And if you answer it correctly, you're still going to get my money. So this is the last question. The CN Tower, where did the CN Tower get its name from? The CN Tower. From the railway? Right. And what was the name of the railway? CN. Well, CN Railway or... Well, I'll go so on. CN stands for what? Yeah. Uh, Canadian National. Right, that's correct, man. That's correct, man. I'm so happy for you, man. So I'm going to leave you with 20 Canadian dollars. Oh, my. That's it. Amazing. Yeah, Trinidad and Tobago, it's your boy Daniel, and we are out here at Trini River Lime here today. And we come out to ask the simple question that we ask around Trinidad and Tobago. What you know? We just want to know what you know. If you know anything you know, you may know. I may not know, but we just want to know what you know. Let me go. What does FBI stand for? A flat bottom Indian. A flat bottom Indian. A flat bottom Indian. A flat bottom in there. A flat bottom in there. What does the F in FBI stand for? Federal. Um, so what does FBI stand for? Federal something something. I ain't sure. I ain't sure. Try a thing now, man. Try, try a thing now, man. I ain't sure. All right, FBI, FBI. Let's see. Uh, federal in. Be inspector business or some shit like that. What? If you have two pools, one pool is five feet deep and the other pool is half as deep as pool number one. How deep is pool number two? One foot. Huh? One foot. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> How much percent alcohol is there in water? 
Well, we about 10 percent. About 10 percent. Yeah. Really, nigga. Can you name any three et ethnic? Can you name any three ethnic? <laughs> So dumb. You are really dumb. For real. Ethnic. Can you name any three ethnic? Negative. Back to my life. But song a tune for me. What kind of tune you want to sing? Any you want to sing? Your favorite tune, darling. My favorite tune, son. Try a tune now. Akila Dome. Is a dunia do me. You drinking today and you drinking forever. Akila. I like that. I like that. Yes, man. Who is this person right here? I have no idea. Come now, try your thing now, man. Go, go, try your thing now, man. I don't know him. I don't. I do not know him. Try your thing, sir. So never see this man face nah. in life. Your whole life you never see this man. I don't know who is that. Come now. Okay. 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 I'll get our next person. Who is this person right here? Um, ANR Robert. Robert. ANR, I know that's uh, ANR. 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 Oh, hell no. Why my name is Ziggy Zack from the Zig to the Zags. Strictly effing sisters and licking shots after facts. No other ways to drop a lip shot to the front. <laughs> the name of part of your body beginning with the letter A. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Can you spell the word Blanche? Shares for me. Blanche. B L A N C. T I S E R R E. B L A N C. T I C E R E S. Oh no. 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 No, 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 no. If a person didn't attend your funeral, would you attend theirs? Yeah? Why? Because you had a little respect. Huh? A little respect for your pain. From the whole of Siparia, from that beginning, nobody had won that. Are you a homo sapien? A what? A what? No, 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 Bob. Nah, straight and hard. You know why it's a homo sapien? No. no. This show is all about education through entertainment, so I want to make sure you learn something before you leave here today. Although I can't get my money, but a homo sapien is the scientific name for a human being. So you are a homo sapien. <laughs> what do you call the distance around the circle? No. Mm -hmm. Circular distance? Circular distance? Circular distance. <laughs> it's actually called the circumference. Well, right. The circumference. Yeah, man. So I want to ensure that you go away learning something here today, man. Name a part of your body that begins with the letter A. Yeah, ass. He's a real ass, you know. <laughs> Name a part of your body that begins with the letter A. Well, is your head? Is your head? Your head? <laughs> what? <laughs> Your head! <laughs> yeah, you're you not use it. <laughs> <laughs> a person working from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. works at 8 hour shift. How many hours does a person work from 8 p.m. to 4 a.m.? Hmm. 8 a.m. to 4 p.m.? Hmm. I'm going to say about 12 hours. Huh? 12? Jesus Christ. Two are called twins and three are called triplets. So what do you call four? Quadruplets. Uh. So so two babies born together, let's call it a twin, yeah. right? So yeah. three babies born together are called a? A twin. Yeah. A twin, like four. A twin, yeah. like four. What? Even two make four. <laughs> I can do. Division. Okay, you're all good in division. What is what is 24 divided by 2? 12. That is what we're talking about, Magma High Five, man. Loving you also. Want next one? Our next division? What is 100 divided by 25? 100 divided by 4. Ah, that's what we're talking about. One more, one more. What is 200 divided by 20? 20. No. 
No, 10. Yeah, all right, all right. And what is 400 divided by 20? 20. All right, and what is 500 divided by 2? 500. What? What is 500 divided by 2? 250. Damn! What is 1,000 divided by 4? 250. All right, and what is what is 5,000 divided by 2? 1,000. No, 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 Shucks. 2,500. Ah, you know your thing, man. Give me a high five, man. Is that, is that anything you want to tell you that I want to be go? Pineapple squad is the best. Pineapple squad is the best. Spell it with jewelry for me. Good <laughs> boy. You're taxing my brain now. What? The G.O.D. night? You know what? Boy, that's been a while, you know. A few moments later. Try, try to take now, man. Spell the word jewelry for me. Oh, jewelry. Jewelry. Come now, man. Try to take now, man. Come now, man. Try that ready. That ready. J. J. E. W. E. Double L. E. R. Y. Name a part of your body that begins with the letter A. It, it have no part of your body that begins with the letter A. <laughs> you sure? <laughs> I like you. <laughs> hold my phone, hold my phone. I like you, hold my phone camera, I like you. Oh, God. Oh, I don't know part of your body that. <laughs> you're good, you're good, you're good. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, well. Go ahead, now, go ahead. Go ahead, now. go 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 this way, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> go, go, my man. <laughs> oh, yeah, go, on, go, on, go, on, go. On. Hey, Canada, it's your boy Daniel, and we are out here in Toronto here today, and we come out to ask the simple question that we ask around the world: What you know? We just want to know what you know. If you know anything you know, you may know, I may not know, but we just want to know what you know. Let me go. So what's your name? Sophia. Sophia. So you see you like your glasses. So go ahead. Take it. Yeah, take it. Go ahead. You're right. Right. She loves the glasses, so she's going to take it from me. <laughs> wow. What is B-U-D-G-E-T? Bad get. <laughs> <laughs> But get it. <laughs> what is an ecosystem? It's something for the environment, I think. It's just like it revolves around the environment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, I don't even know. Yeah, see, this show is all about education through entertainment. So an ecosystem is a large community of living organisms in a particular area. All right. All right. So you learned something today. So if you didn't know, now you know. What are the vowels of the alphabet? The vowels of the alphabet is like... The vowels of the alphabet is like A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, P, E, X, Z, Y, N, Z, Go down. <laughs> so the alphabet is like not backwards, you have to go frontwards and the alphabet. So I like you in it. Yeah. So what are the vowels of the alphabet? The vowels of the alphabet is like I would say it's an alphabet, but you have to pronounce it the proper way, the right way. How you have to pronounce it, the alphabet. So it's like if you had to pronounce the alphabet the right way, you have to go from A, B, C, go all the way down okay. to Z. Okay. Now all the way. What is a continent? A uh, place where all the cities are in. Uh, we're in we're the, our continent is Ontario. <laughs> I'm going to sleep. <laughs> I'm only going to laugh. <laughs> no, no. Our A continent is a large area of land on earth that is joined together. So you learned something. What do you call a group of porcupines? I don't know, a quill? You call them a prickle. A prickle. Yeah, this show is all about education through entertainment. It's called a prickle. Do you know what they call a collection of tigers? Wow. 
I didn't know that one. But you see, this show is all about education through entertainment. Yeah, you tell me. A streak. A streak. You know what a group of uh, owls are? It's a good one. I don't know. A parliament. Huh? A parliament. A parliament. How about, wow. How about monkeys? Wow. Oh, my God. He, he flipped the script on my hair. Monkeys. A troop? A troop? Yeah, it goes by a troop right. or a barrel of monkeys. Wow. More fun than a barrel of monkeys. Well, that is correct. Yeah. So what did you learn today? What have I learned? Right. I've learned that you don't know your animal groups. Oh. Oh! What does AC stand for? AC? Yeah. I like him. I it's him. just AC. And I just like, not mean like Collier, just AC. So it's just A. A is for the alphabet A. Take care. C is just like AC. What is B U D G E T? Bucket. 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 Tell me something in Italian. Ciao, come stai? Oh. What does that mean? Do you like pizza? Do I like pizza? Ti piace la pizza? And how do I say yes, I like pizza? Yeah, see si me piace la pizza. Si me piace la pizza. <laughs> Name a word that begins with the letter X. Xylophone. All right, that is correct, man. And because you're so lucky, you didn't answer all my questions correct, but I'm still going to leave you with two gift cards here. So you could get $5 off your next $25 purchase at the workshop here. And you could also save 10%. 20% at this entertainment city here. Thanks very much. Yeah, give me a high five, man. That was, that was a good job, man. What is B-U-D-G-E-T? Podcast? Yeah. Podcast? Yeah. Oh my God. Can you spell the word Niagara for me? N I A G R A. N I A G R A. You see, this show again is all about education through entertainment, and that is a common misconception. The word Niagara is spelled N I A G A R A. Oh man. Did you know that? So if you didn't know, now you know. Uh, give me a high five here. I mean, you didn't answer all my questions correctly, but you know, I'm still gonna leave you with. I'm still gonna leave you with a gift card. You ever been to the zoo? No. Well, I'm sending you to the zoo. Hold that. <laughs> <laughs> what does the E in email stand for? I was gonna say internet, but that's not I. <laughs> Everywhere. Wrong, 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 wrong. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Everywhere, everywhere mail. Everyone. <laughs> everyone. <laughs> everyone. Uh, that, that's impressive indeed. <laughs> really impressive. Whoa. Whoa, just... Whoa. Bravo. What? <laughs> really impressive. It sounds for electronic. Oh. oh. I knew that. Absolutely. Look, listen, stop it. No, don't, don't, no, 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 no. Don't do it. Oh, where are you from? Where I'm from? Yeah. I'm from Toronto here. Lying will ruin your life. Lying will ruin your goddamn life. Alright. Oh right, yeah, I'm from right, Toronto. From Toronto. Oh yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Where's the capital of Canada? Capital of Canada? Boy, let me see something. Else. Capital of Canada, uh hold up there, hold up there. I know it, I know it, hold up. Capital of Canada, hold up, I know it. Hold up there. Let me see, hold up, hold up, hold up. Mm, mm. You catch me on one day. I know it, I know it's in the brain here. Why you always lying? Mm, oh my god. Boy, I get that one off guard, you know. But I know that one, I know it. It's puzzling now, it's puzzling me. You catch me off guard at it. You catch me off guard at it. Let me see. Let me see. I know it, I know it, I know it, but it's hard to come out. You have to go back to our next one. I have something different. That's something different. I missed that one. It's puzzling me now. Get going something different again. And I will see something. Can we get serious now? If NOT spells not and ICE spells ICE, then what is NOT? ICE. That's uh. 
that's icing peanut that's um it's not all of them and was not ice and those so not is not yeah and ice is ice so what is n o t i c e ice not not ice ice not i see a man completely out of control completely out of control no not ice no not not um not not that's not ice ice not not iceland no and not not no okay we are full day don't worry yeah yeah we are whole night uh, whole day yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god! Wow! Yeah, well, yeah, well, yeah, well. I mean, you ain't got my questions correct, but I'm still gonna leave you with some gift cards here so you could go, you know, go, go pick up something, man. I like your bad, you know. Right. I like your bad. Right. Yeah, man. Big up yourself. You wanna say anything? Oh, just welcome to Toronto. That's it. Hey, St. Vincent, this is your boy Daniel, and we're out here in Kingston here today, and we come out to ask you the simple question that we ask around the world. What you know? We just want to know what you know. If you know anything you know, you may know, I may not know, but we just want to know what you know. And if you didn't know, now you know. Let me go. Name six animals that live in water. My God. I am one of the animals for sure. I am one of the animals. I am a lion. <laughs> I am one of the animal. I am a lion. <laughs> if one year has 12 months, then how many months are there in four years? <laughs> 34. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Hey, son! You're not telling me I'll operate, you know? No, that's alright, that's alright. See, I'm going to give me things like ABC, no problem. C, C, A, T, Cat, right. R, O, T, but them kind of thing now. So you're not too bright? I'm telling you the truth, because... What A, B, C? Well, I'm only telling you how I stand. How many letters are there in the alphabet? Well, I tell you I'll operate. Oh. I roll up on the street. Sing the alphabet for me. I can't sing it neither. <laughs> <laughs> in the United States of America, right? 9-11 mm. occurred September 11th, 2001, right? Mm. So therefore, if all of this happened, in which year did 9-11 occur? 2011. Oh, Lord of mercy. 2011. So in the United States of America, 9-11 occurred September 11, 2001. Mm. So if all of this happened, then in which year did 9-11 occur? Same year. Which year? 2011, I see. If the color orange is spelled O-R-A-N-G-E, then how do you spell the fruit orange? Spell the fruit orange for me. F R U T fruit orange. <laughs> Same thing. Wow. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, spell fruit orange. Right. So spell oh, right. R G E. Right. Right. So spell orange for me. O N G E N orange. <laughs> Orange. Watch, listen, listen. All of them point. Watch, you see all of them there? All of them listening. Watch. Yeah, we're going on. Not all the questions. I am going to know. I'm telling you. You check it. I am. I am. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, come, come, come. Come, 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 come. So now that's what I do. I spell fruit orange. That's what the man tell me. You check it. So, so spell orange for me. Well, I look, 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 look at this. Somebody come look at this. O N A G E N. Look at this. Somebody come and look at this. Look at this. This show, this show is all about education through entertainment. I spelled it for you. It's O R 
A N G E. So spell it with orange for me. O R A N G E. That is correct, man. Make up yourself. Man. But it, that they are telling you just now. The lie detector determined that was a lie. <laughs> That they are telling you just now, but I, I put fruit in front of the orange. That is all. I like that much. Just fruit I put in front of the orange. So. Any, anything you want to say before we go? All right. I want somebody else come up and talk to. Who come in? Kids, this is one of the number one reasons why I continue to say, kids. Stay in school. If it is 3.50 p.m. right now, then what time will it be 20 minutes after Lenny? If it is 3.50 p.m. What time will it be 20 minutes after Lenny? And 20 minutes after? Yes. That's will be um, 3.40. Yes. Oh, we yes. 3.50 p.m. What time will it be 20 minutes after? That's will be 3.70. <laughs> that's will be 370. What the hell was that? I don't know. I don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> that's will be 370. <laughs> <laughs> so there we are. You need to check out Bristol's Pest, the number one pest control company in Grenada and also offering regional services to hotels, homes, restaurants and much more. They specialize in rodents control, termites control, all types of cockroaches, bats, and all other creeping and crawling insects. Give them a call today at area code 1473-403-3532 or 534-0174. Can you use the word excellent in a sentence for me? Life is how you make it. Life is how you live it. Life goes on. Life is the street people that you meet. Some people smile, but they don't smile. What do you smile for? Tell me. Yo, 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 yo. What do you smile for? Entertainer. Uh -huh. That's who? I love you. You know? Which part of your body is your patella located? This all, right? This all. Where? Right there. Where, right where? This same place. Oh, hell no. Oh, oh, oh. Which part of your body is your patella located? Around here, so? <laughs> where? Like where? Like, like here? Yeah. Like here? Yeah. So your patella is located? <laughs> yeah. This show is all about education through entertainment. Your patella is another word for your kneecap. I said right there, so. I did to the so. So I get it right the first time. Why you always lying? Oh my God. Who is the current Governor General of St. Vincent? I'm afraid that the current General is not appointed as yet. Um, one died just the other day. He just buried um, last week sometime. Um, presently, we don't have a current Governor General. Do we? Well, if we do, I, I know about him, ma'am. Yeah. Hey, ma Next question. Hey, ma -ho. Oh, well. Uh, it'd be a woman. I don't know. Oh, I love women. Oh, wow. I am delivered. I love women, too. I said I like women. Women, 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 women. I said women. Um, this show is all about education through entertainment, and it's Suzanne Duggan. What? Miss Susan Duggan. Miss Susan Susan Duggan? Yeah. That's who? The, who, 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 who? Oh, you're yeah, now informing me that Miss Susan Duggan is the new appointed Governor General. Of, of St. Vincent, correct? Well, thank you. Um, I just know. And if you didn't know, I know no, no. now. So 9-11. I could September 11, 2001. So therefore, if all of this happened, in which year did 9-11 occur? How are you helping me with that? No, you... How are you helping me with that? That's all. How are you helping me with that? Even if I lose, I lose. Somebody has changed. 
Pana, help me with that. I will listen to me one more time. I don't want to no more. I don't want to no more. I say you help me, you help me. Listen now, listen. I'm begging you. I'm begging you to let me. I'm begging you. I walk away. <laughs> this show is all about education through entertainment. 9 11 occurred September 11th, 2001. I tell the man the answer. What is St. Vincent's high speak? Speak Spanish and French. Yeah. <laughs> yes, eh? Uh, yeah, laugh. No, because have you tell me I want to answer my questions and I ask any questions. You can't tell me one day. Javi, this is the final question. The final question here before I go. A really simple question, right? Really simple question. How many islands make up St. Vincent and the Grenadines? Plenty of islands. How much? Plenty. Plenty. Jesus is Lord. Yeah. Plenty. Yeah. This show is all about education through entertainment. St. Vincent and the Grenadines is made up of 32 islands and keys. So if you didn't know, who is the current Governor General of St. Vincent? Um... Marilyn Monroe. <laughs> so the current Governor General of St. Vincent is Mrs. Monroe. Mrs. Monroe. <laughs> the current Governor General of St. Vincent is Miss Susan Duggan. Susan Duggan. Yeah. Okay. In the United States of America, 9-11 occurred September 11, 2001. So if all of this happened, in which year did 9-11 occur? September 11, 2001. If it is 3.50 p.m. right now, then what time will it be 20 minutes after? 20 minutes after? 3.50 p.m.? Minutes to 25 to 4. 25 to 3. What is an autobiography? Catch me from your belly now, man. What is an autobiography? Tell me. Autobiography is um, is um. <laughs> what is an autobiography? Why are you What is an autobiography? <laughs> An autobiography is an account of a person's life written by that person. Yes. It 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 slipped me. Because I get it already. Oh boy. <laughs> it's alright, but now you know what an autobiography is. Yes. <laughs> so if you didn't know I didn't know it before, but I it, 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 this thing does you know the old man getting old, eh? Yeah, <laughs> but Daniel Love, let's come to remind you, man. If general elections occur in St. Vincent every five years, and this year there's a general election, then in which year will be the next general election of St. Vincent? Oh, that's like five years from now again. Which, which, yeah. which year? Uh, next, next, next five years, that is, um, two, let me see. Now it's what, 2000, 2000, yeah, uh -huh. 2010. Mm. <laughs> 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 it was. You're right. Too. Yeah, 2000. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Huh? 2020, 2020, 2020, yeah. Right, so which which year will be the next general election of St. Vincent? Huh? Yeah, come on, yeah, 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 have it, yeah, have yeah, it. Yeah. yeah, yeah, have it. Which year will be the next general election? This year. Right, yeah, so if, so if this year, they, this year they have a general election, yeah. so when will be the next general elections of St. Vincent? Next five years. Which will be which year? Next five years. To, to 2006, to 2026, 26. <laughs> 26. You, you can do it, you can do it. If this year they have having general elections, we're in 2020 right now. This year in St. Vincent they have having general elections. So which, which year will they have the next general elections of St. Vincent? Uh, 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 come on, you can do it, you can do it. Come, come, come. Come, bring it back up with me, Belly, man. 2005. Guys, what? 
2005. <laughs> <laughs> Who is the current Governor General of St. Vincent? St. Vincent was a champion. I am the General and the Governor. <laughs> if 9 11 occurred on September 11, 2001, and all of this happened, then in which year did 9 11 occur? September 11, yeah. So, uh, where are they now? So, which year did this occur? Which year? Mm -hmm. September, well, well, this year in America. That was um, the year, that was 91, 1990. That was in 1990. Hey, California, this is your boy Daniel, and we out here in Los Angeles here today. And we come out to ask the simple question that we ask around the world. What you know? We just want to know what you know. If you know anything you know, you may know, I may not know, but we just want to know what you know. And if you didn't know, now you know. Let me go. Which continent is both a country and a continent? Anus. What? Africa. Anus. Come, come, what? Come help him. Anus. <laughs> My anus. So which, so which continent is both a country and a continent? My anus. My anus. My anus is a continent and a country. <laughs> This show, this show is all about education through entertainment. Oh no, man, it's what you know, brother. <laughs> but what I know and what I can tell you <clears throat> is that Australia is a continent and a country. Ah, Australia. If you don't know, now you know. What is a cockpit? What is a cockpit? It's in a plane. It's the pilot seat. You smart. You loyal. You grateful. I appreciate that. What is a cockpit? My inners. My anus is a cockpit. <laughs> My anus is a cockpit. <laughs> My anus is a cockpit. <laughs> what is evaporation? Evaporation is when you evaporate something. You move something from one place to another place. Like what? Like a goat. You pick up this thing and put it, you carry it up. Like what? Or what? You move something from. You move that even below, I bring it up. So higher stage. Okay, so therefore if I pick up this here and you put it up far up, that is evaporating. Evaporation. So if I pick up this bottle right here mm -hmm. and I raise it up. Evaporating. Alright. And I pick up this right here and I raise it up. Evaporating. <laughs> Yeah, we in right now. This is the year of the rat. It's the Chinese New Year. It's the year of the rat. Yeah. So, so which, 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 which year are we in right now? Millennium, millennium, twenty, twenty-first century. No. Like which year? Like you know, there's the year two thousand and two, two thousand and three. So which year are we in right now? I guess it's 2004 since you did 2002, 2003. <laughs> what is the name of Guyana's flag? Um, hold on, hold on. Did you touch up? Oh, no, 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 no. Charlie, don't do that. Oh, my God. So how many calories are there in water? Six. Uh, six. Six. Six calories. Six calories. So water has... Six calories. <laughs> what does M A C H I N E spell? My My <laughs> Can you spell the word pneumonia for me? No. <laughs> try, try, try. Pneumonia. Yeah, pneumonia. K. What? K N E W. M O N I A. <laughs> this show is all about education through entertainment and it's all about laughter and learning. So we teach people that it's okay to laugh at yourself and it's okay for others to laugh at you. So it's okay if we laugh at you a little bit, right? Yeah. It's okay, yeah. right. But pneumonia is spelled P N E U M O N I A. <laughs> Close enough. What does M A C H I N E spell? 
Maxen Mark Hain. Is it Mark Hain? Look, 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 look at this. Somebody come look at this. Look at this. Mark Hain. It's Mark Hain. Yeah, Mark Hain. Right. right. Not Hain. Not Hain. M A C H A N E. H I N E. Mark Hain. When he was 10 years old, your best friend was half your age, right? You're 35 now. How old is your best friend? My best friend was five at half of my age. If, how much is he now? It's gone by. 25. That's a tricky question, buddy. Half of me age when I was 10 is 5. Half of me age now. Oh, it's gone. 25. How old is 25? So half of 35 is 25. Oh, not half of 35 is 25. Ask my big question, buddy. When he was 10 years old, right. your best friend was half your age. He was five. All right. So now that you're 35, how old is your best friend? Oh, Scanto, 15. <laughs> what the? I got a one, I got a one, I got a one. Hey, hey. Help me, my show, my honey. Hey, help me, my show, my honey. You know. <laughs> Well, you know I bounce up Usain Bolt in Las Vegas and I'm going to ask him. <laughs> it's my boy from Trinidad, man. Big up my boy yeah, from no, Trinidad. No, hold on, hold on. <laughs> I'm not from Trinidad. Oh, shucks, I was wrong. I'm Jamaican. Okay. And I'm Nigerian. All right. Okay. All right. But born and raised right. in Canada. All right. So let's straighten it up. But wifey is Trini. Yes, right. yes, yes. So if, so if wifey is Trini, you is a Trini too no, then. No, 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 no. That is not correct. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't listening to any country at all. All right. Cool. All right, cool. My son is Trini. All right. That's where we start. All right. All right, Usain, this is the first question. Can you can you spell the word pneumonia for me? Pneumonia. Yeah. P N E M N U I O. I think that's wrong because I, I, think, I, think, I, think, I think it's wrong, but I'm gonna blame it on the Johnny. Promise me love period in terms of years did Mahatma Gandhi serve as president of the United States of America Mahatma Gandhi uh, yeah. so, you, so you serve four years right and you get two terms so wait he was impeached <laughs> Mahatma Gandhi was impeached right He's one of the three presidents that was impeached. That's right. It was, it was only three years, just like Donald Trump. Let's put it this way. There is absolutely no collusion. So, so, so which period, like in terms of years, uh, you, you know, which period did Mahatma Gandhi serve as, as president? Around the disco era? Around hmm? the disco? Around disco era? Disco. Disco, yeah. Major, that, that's nonsense. And you should know better. Spell the word pneumonia for me, Juni. Oh my god. Oh, you got this. It's a P H E N U. I don't know. I miss an M. I don't even like that. I don't even like the look. I try Try your thing now, man. Try, 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 try your thing. Try your thing. Okay, okay, okay. P H M. It's spelled hella weird. E U. I don't know. M I N O. One more time. One, one more time. Julie, one more time. Okay, okay. Wait, what was the question? Spell the word pneumonia. You want to come help her? Huh? Can, can you spell pneumonia? What was it? You said pneumonia. Spell the word pneumonia. Oh my god. P N E U M O N I A. That is correct. <laughs> yes. Which month is the second month of the year? January. Okay, so if January is the second month of the year, which month is the third month of the year? December. Okay, and if December is the third month of the year, then which, which month is the twelfth month of the year? January. You're going to slap down those people. That's stupid! Use your common sense. Name the five human senses. Sight, 
Right. You got this. You got Smell, this. touch, right. feel, right. all that touch. Right. Um, what else do I do? Uh, <laughs> Can you spell the word pneumonia for me? Right. <laughs> I, I don't speak English. You don't speak English? No. Why you always lying? Oh my God. If someone did not attend your funeral, Anne, would you attend theirs? Yes. What? I mean, it depends on the person. If I, yeah, pro I probably would. Yeah. Why? 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 Because I care about people. Is <laughs> oh, oh, oh. a sweet aunt. I'm so sorry. So if someone didn't attend your funeral, you'd attend theirs? I would, yeah. Right. I just need a little more a little more detail as to why you do something like this. Why would you attend this person's funeral if they did not attend yours? I don't know, out of respect I guess. <laughs> I don't know. You're a real respectable lady, but I like that. <laughs> So which period did Mahatma Gandhi serve as President of the United States of America? Which period? Oh, you know, who was his Vice President? I think it was A Andrew Hamilton, right? <laughs> I mean, this show is all about education through entertainment. Mahatma Gandhi actually did not serve as a President of the United States of America. Wait, he was... Of America? Yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking about a different United States. <laughs> <laughs> Which other um, United States we were getting up, getting up. Yeah. Okay, I mean, but I mean, to the end of the day, this show is all about education through entertainment. Mahatma Gandhi was actually the leader of India's non violent movement against British rule. Right, I knew that. Yeah, so he's really, huh? <laughs> Nothing. Uh, this, I mean, this is a little joke. Yeah. Jokey joke. Joke, yeah. I mean, it's, it's, it's just a, I mean, a joke. Hey, Las Vegas, this is your boy Daniel, and we out here on the strip here today, and we come out to ask the simple question that we ask around the world. What you know? We just want to know what you know. If you know anything you know, you may know, I may not know, but we just want to know what you know. And if you didn't know, now you know. Let me go. What is the 13th month of the year? Is there a 13th month of the year? Yeah, that's only when you group together all the leap years that have passed, and it would equal the zodiac sign of the Capricious, and that month would be called Wagateri. 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 W-A-G-A-T-A-R-Y. Wagatori. W-A-G-A-T-O-R-Y. I mean, you get the, the, the leap year when you have that day that uh, February is not 28, but it equals 29. After so many years, you add that extra day that you get um, from uh, February being 29, and then you eventually you get 31 of those bonus uh, days, and they equal a month called Wagatory, the 13th month uh, of the calendar. <laughs> you learn something every day, boy. <laughs> In the show Tom and Jerry, what type of animal is Jerry? Uh, I think Jerry is a, is a eagle. That's stupid! Use your common sense. It's an eagle, yeah. Because eagle will fly high, man, you know what I mean? Talking about like above the sky, man, you know? The cloud, you know? You know, you know what I'm saying? The storm be down there, you know what I mean? Yeah. What about your teeth on I want some money? Hey, but you know, hey, you know Tommy from, you know, from Power, you know what I mean? Yeah, but Tommy. Yeah. <laughs> Tommy, so, so we're talking about the same show or what? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell was that? What was that? I normally has 12 months. So in a leap year, what is the 13th month of the year? I thought a leap year only had like eight months or something like that. In which period did Mahatma Gandhi serve as president of the United States of America? Is he black? Oh Lord have mercy. Or is he white? No! Follow me on Instagram. My name is Mala Ray. Out here in Las Vegas. Period. Poo. No! Which country is Las Vegas located in? It's located in North America, which is actually on the continent of um, Americano Islando. Uh, Americano Islando, Islando. It's like um, 
a Latin termination for the continent American. Like uh, America, the continent is pronounced Americano Islando, but uh, Las Vegas and Nevada are located in the country North America. That means the United States section of Mexico, um, the U.S. and Canada on one continent. That would be North America. <laughs> <laughs> what is the thirteenth month? From Africa, man. What are you talking about? Right, so, what is the thirteenth month of the I year? I don't speak English. What are you? Huh? I don't speak English. <laughs> that does not have my language, man. My language is African. Ask me something in African, man. You know. <laughs> so, what's the thirteenth month of the year? Oh, uh, that, that's a hard question, man. Yeah, what is the 13th month of the year? Um, that's my birthday and I've been, we've been waiting for my birthday for a long time, man, you know, on the 13th month. <laughs> what is 50% of 14? That's uh, 5. 15% of, um, what? Would you say 5% of 14 is 5, right? 50% of 14, that's 5. 50% um, of 14 is 5. 14 divided by 5, you have to put a 0 for 140, then you divide it straight down the middle. It goes into it uh, 3 times minus 1, that's 3.2.5, and then you add it together, but you subtract the uh, bonus point, and that gives you 5. That's, that equals 2.5 plus 2.5 in division, and that's 5. It's the square root of 14, the division way, 50%, instead of uh, divided by. I've been all over the world, um, to Canada, London, Guyana, and I have, I have never met someone like you. Thank you. All right. What? I think. <laughs> <laughs> Can you spell the word pneumonia for me, Red? P-H-E-N-O-M-I-A. P-H-E-N-O. Wait, I just messed up. I said it right the first time. No! No! P-H. I'm so confused now. Y'all killing me. <laughs> N-E-M-O-A. <laughs> Sorry. No, no more. Oh, it has a P H N E. I don't even know. Hold on, I tell us it though. Hold on. P H N E M O I A. I'm gonna guess. This show is all about education through entertainment. So we're gonna, Hello. so we're gonna laugh at you guys a little bit, or maybe a lot, it's but, right or wrong. but it's wrong. But I'm gonna tell you, yeah, it was wrong. But I'm gonna educate you. I was close. I wasn't close at all. I know I had the PH right. PH O. I don't know. Okay, so so you could bet. So you could bet a hundred dollars right now that you had the PH correct. Yeah, I'm hundred dollars for sure. I had the PH first. Let me see your hundred dollars before we move before we move forward. I got Apple Pay and I got Zelle. All right, all right, cool. So, all right. So I'm gonna take my payments via Apple Pay. The okay. correct spelling of pneumonia is P N E U M O N I A. <laughs> No, there's an H in it though. What? <laughs> Congratulations, you played yourself. You bring tears to my eyes, boy. Oh gosh. Thank you. So, no, but this show is all about education through entertainment. 50% of 14 is 7. Well, it depends on what you believe in because if you say 50% um, of 14 is 7, if you get a math uh, test and you, and you have 14 questions and you only get... Um, Seven of them right, you don't get 50%, you get an F. That's like 25%. <laughs> you, you cannot answer seven of them right and get a 50%. <laughs> Spell the word pneumonia for me. I'm going to go with N E W N M O N A. M O N A. That was like. I mean, I'm all songs like Mona Lisa to me, but all right, listen, listen, listen. I'm going to tell you the correct answer. We're going to laugh at you a little bit. That's okay, right? Yeah, that's right. pretty funny. All right, so yeah. pneumonia is P-N-E-U-M-O-N-I-A. Dang, that is crazy, y'all. That's, 
That's a trick. That is a trick. But if you didn't know, now you know. Yeah, I know. In which period did Mahatma Gandhi serve as president of the United States of America? That's a good question. You got that one? Because I don't. 1955. <laughs> 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 I, don't, I don't know that one. <laughs> don't say nothing. It's better to say something than to say nothing at all. Oh. Mahatma Gandhi never served as the president of the United States of America. Oh, I was like, who is that? I never heard that president before. <laughs> yeah, I don't. Mm -mm. He actually led the non-violent movement in India, which led to India's independence. You never heard of Mahatma Gandhi? Hell no. Gandhi? Huh? I've heard of Gandhi. Yeah, not right. Mahatma Gandhi. Right. <laughs> so, right. so his first name is Mahatma. Mahatma okay. Gandhi. Okay. So if you didn't know, now you know. Let's say someone did not attend your funeral. Would you attend theirs? No, I wouldn't because if you wouldn't attend mine, I wouldn't attend yours. That's messed up, right? Because that means you don't show love to me. That means I'm not going to show love to you. You know what I mean? So. You going to come to my funeral? You going to come to my funeral? No, I want to know if someone did not attend your funeral, if you would attend theirs. I know. So I want, I'm not attending nobody's funeral if they don't want to attend my funeral. You know what I mean? But unless it's my mom, like she did if she didn't want to attend it because she's too sad, then I understand. I'll still attend hers, you know what I mean? Yeah, that way. I can see if somebody didn't want to attend because they're too sad to go. That's understandable. Other than that, yeah, I'm not attending if they do not want to come. Your level of understanding and compassion is unmatched. So, so I, 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 need, I need to understand this. So, so 50% and, and a half is not the same thing? No, that's just dividing 14 coconuts into di two different piles. If you want to actually get 50% of a coconut, a coconut is husk and flesh. And the flesh uh, has liquid, like a coconut milk. So if you wanted to make 50% of a coconut, you'd have to cut it in half so you could get the outside and the inside instead of just setting it differently from another coconut. So if there's 14, the only way to get 50% is to actually get um, 4.50, which rounds up to 50. Otherwise, you would end up getting um, 14 something split in half. That uh, that's a question called uh, what is 14 split in half? <laughs> so, what are the vowels of the alphabet then? Um, all I gotta say is the letter D because my name's Drake. That's all I gotta say, y'all. Letter D because my name's Drake. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <bottle. laughs> right, so what are the vowels of the alphabet? Vowels? Um, I don't even know, y'all, so I need to go back to school. Take try, me. try, try. You could do it. This is the final Thank question. Really, I haven't been school in a minute, y'all. This is the final question here. What are the vowels of the alphabet? The vowels of the alphabet? Uh -huh. A, B, C, E, F, G. H I J, element of P, A, Q R S, element of P. Hey, 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 hey. In which continent is the country Jamaica located in? Bahamas. <laughs> there ain't no continent. It's, it would be America, if anything. So like, so like, I'm from Trinidad and Tobago, right? So Trinidad and Tobago is a part of America. Yeah, just like Barbados. What, 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 where you go? So, so I am a citizen of America then, technically. Correct. <laughs> America, see, it's the difference between America and United States. This is United States, so the citizenship is more, you know what I'm saying, a boundary, but at the same time, it doesn't take away from America. The only part that ain't America is Canada. So, as a citizen of Trinidad and Tobago, I automatically am a citizen of the United States. No. America. So, I am an American? Yeah. <laughs> You're still American. They're just not from the United States. Yes. I love that. So, that's it. That's it. Respect, buddy. Respect. Yeah, man. Is it a prize? <laughs> <laughs>
Um, well, I, I guess, um, I'm an American now. <laughs>